Transportation and the movement of people and goods, whether it be by vehicle, bike, or by foot, is a vital part to any city's core foundation. Here in Temecula, building and maintaining our critical infrastructure to allow ease in transportation has remained a priority since city inception over 32 years ago. As Temecula continues to evolve into a dynamic economic powerhouse, so do our infrastructure needs expand. In June 2021, the city approved a $700 million capital improvement budget, or CIP budget for short, the largest ever in Temecula's history. City funding contributes roughly 24% of the total CIP funding, with outside sources such as federal and state grants and regional revenue sources such as Riverside County's Transportation Uniform Mitigation Fees making up the remainder of the budget. 92 carefully planned projects over the next five years are sure to make a positive impact on all of Temecula's residents. Let's take a look at some of the projects that are included in this capital improvement budget, which are expected to start construction over the next 12 months. Temecula, get ready to move! French Valley Parkway, Phase 2 this project will construct two northbound lanes on the I-15 freeway, approximately 2.5 miles long. The new lanes will start on I-15 from Winchester Road to the I-15-215 junction and include a flyover bridge. This will help correct the daily choke point on the northbound Interstate 15, where weaving occurs as drivers choose between I-15 and I-215 while at the same time, vehicles are merging from off of Winchester Road and onto northbound I-15. Groundbreaking for this $138 million project is expected to occur mid-2022. I-15 Freeway Congestion Relief Project New auxiliary lanes will be constructed along the I-15 freeway between all on-ramps and off-ramps in Temecula. The first lane, northbound I-15 from Temecula Parkway to Rancho California Road, is expected to start construction by the end of 2022. Freeway Beautification Plan While speaking of freeway off-ramps, the southbound Temecula Parkway freeway off-ramp that was completed in 2019 will be going through a landscape beautification upgrade. The city, in conjunction with sponsorship from our partners, Pachanga Band of Luiseno Indians and Visit Temecula Valley, will be creating an enhanced landscape and hardscape plan that will communicate a strong sense of arrival and warm welcome to those entering Temecula. Nicholas Road Extension and Multipurpose Trail on the northeastern part of town, construction will soon start on the road extension of Nicholas Road from Summers Bend's westerly boundary to Calle Girasol and Leifer Road. The project will also include a culvert crossing at Santa Gertrudis Creek. This project will bring needed relief for those living in the area and will also provide an efficient northern access route towards wine country. Diaz Road Expansion Diaz Road will be converted into a major four-lane arterial between Rancho California Road and Cherry Street, bringing additional roadway infrastructure to the city's business park corridor. Construction will start from Winchester to Rancho California in 2022. Building critical infrastructure is not only being planned, but maintaining and improving the city's existing roads and facilities are also a priority. This year, the City of Temecula will upgrade and repair over 3 million square feet of roads through our Pavement Rehabilitation Program, including much of the city's business park and major access roads, including Butterfield Stage, Yanez Road, Paba Road, and Winchester Road. We will also start renovating and upgrading a few city facilities over the next 12 months. Margarita Recreation Center Located at the Michael Mike Nagar Park off Margarita Road, the former YMCA building will be dismantled and a new intergenerational recreation center with a pool will be built in its place. Mary Phillips Senior Center. Enhancement and renovation at the Mary Phillips Senior Center, including exterior improvements and much needed accessibility improvements to the interior will also take place. 
pickleball courts will be constructed at Wolf Creek Park, balancing the amenities currently offered on the south side of town. In striving to maintain a healthy balance of transportation modes, the city puts great effort into planning connectivity, construction and maintenance of trails and bike paths through the city. Here are a few projects you will see in the coming months. Trail lighting will be installed to the east side of the creek between 1st Street and Rancho California Road in Old Town. Extension of the pedestrian bike trail from Yanez Road to Murrieta Creek Multi-Trail on Diaz Road. This is just a snapshot of the 92 projects scheduled in the city's five-year capital improvement program, all aimed at prioritizing public infrastructure in an effort to move to Mecula Ford and beyond this year, providing quality of life for years to come.